This spring, nearly 400 applications for summer internship opportunities streamed into IACME's Knoxville headquarters. The submissions came from undergraduate and graduate level students at more than 116 colleges and universities. Each applicant vying for a coveted position at one of five IACME partner locations. In the end, just 15 students, less than 4% of the applicants were selected and awarded a paid 10-week internship. So what are they doing this summer? I'm developing a system to measure the linear density of carbon fiber, and I'm doing so by exciting the fiber with an air pulse. We're working on doing some pre-preg carbon layup, so that's carbon fiber that already has resin impregnated in it, and we are making parts of an airplane wing. I'm working here at ORNL to develop a better process to recycle carbon fiber composites. Right now I'm working with a professor um, to basically develop an additive to a composite material that would be able to improve the manufacturing process. Most of my thesis study has been with polyurethane foams, so we're replacing the petroleum-based polyol and incorporating a bio-based polyol and increasing the bio-based content of the foams. The main focus of the work I've been doing with the team has been mechanical testing of carbon fiber toes, the um, cured samples of the fiber. I'm thinking about working in industry and I really wanted some experience working with other disciplines. I hope to expand my 3D modeling abilities and my hands-on experience and expertise being able to use the language and the vocabulary of the industry. We're doing stuff that people haven't ever done before here, so trying to actually figure this out and have it actually work is super exciting. You learn it better, kind of diving into the problem and really seeing how it works and how you build the system to evaluate it and how you process the data. Being a PhD student, I'm absolutely a fan of academia, but I understand that it's important to have some hands-on experience to complement what you learn in the classroom. The hands-on aspect of this internship has given me an amazing opportunity to experience real-world applications for composites. You get a real understanding of what you're working with. It's hard to go up to the higher theoretical aspects when you really don't know if it's possible to produce what you're thinking of. Just the amount of troubleshooting that's involved in the engineering. Um, most of my time spent figuring out why things aren't working the way they're, I'm expecting them to, and I had no idea of that coming into it. The specific skills that I expected to learn aren't what I'm actually learning now, and it's actually a good thing, the things that I'm learning now. I'm learning how to model materials at the basic level, I'm learning how to do actual physical testing in the lab, and problem solving is a huge thing that I'm learning. I would definitely recommend applying for an IACME internship. Uh, one of the great things is that basically my job here seems to be to learn, and so that's a really awesome opportunity for a student to come and be able to get experience and just learn about the industry. Not only is it competitive with other commercial um, internships that you can, can uh, get into, uh, it's, it's also a great way to expand your knowledge. You are working on the leading edge of innovation and being able to collaborate with not only academic but industry partners with hundreds of people that have an experience that you can benefit from. So if you have the opportunity to take an IACB internship, I would definitely recommend it. This experience has really gotten me thinking about a career in the field in the future. I had no inclination to go into composites, but after working here, I'm at least interested and willing to learn more. My original idea for after graduation was to work somewhere in vehicles for sure, and mainly focusing on engines. But now that I've actually touched this composite aspect of vehicles, maybe there's a career path that way for me because it's interested me very much so far. The interesting thing about an internship is it gives a student an opportunity to come in contact with the technology. This means in many cases they're going to learn new computer tools, new methods for modeling the manufacturing and the design processes and composite materials and systems. And I think these internships will help us understand how we develop the human talent needed to support the new technology in composites manufacturing for the automotive industry and for wind and compressed gas.